Did you know that Emperor Palpatine could not start his day without a cup of coffee, and he loved it so much that he owned various farms on various planets? We're going to be looking at that in today's video. So I don't know if you've noticed this, but food and drink is pretty important in Star Wars. Whether it's in Episode 1 where we see TC-14 serve drinks to Obi-Wan Kenobi and Qui-Gon, or in Episode 4 with the Mos Eisley Cantina, or in Episode 2 where we see Anakin and Padme share fruit, food and drink is almost in every film. And after re-watching the sequel trilogy recently, it got me thinking. What kind of food do they eat in Star Wars? What kind of drinks do they have? And that led me down a deeper spiral of thought until I was thinking, is coffee even a thing in Star Wars? Does it exist? Which got me also thinking, what other things are there in the human world that exist in Star Wars? So I did some research online about coffee and drinks in general, and today I'm going to be talking about it. And believe me, it's far more interesting than it sounds. Or maybe you find it interesting. Either way, let's get to the video. So the first thing I stumbled upon was the fact that there is actually caffeine in Star Wars. There are drinks which are stimulants, just like caffeine is. So there are basically times where people will drink caffeine to wake themselves up in Star Wars. And then I basically found out which drinks in the Star Wars universe are caffeinated. And the first one we're going to talk about is a thing called Cath. Caff is basically a weak stimulant beverage, which is brewed from caff beans. It's the Star Wars equivalent to coffee, and it looks pretty much the same. It was native to the planets Garki and Chara, and on many planets you could buy instant caff, just like you can buy instant coffee in the human world. But many people, just like in the human world, prefer the brewed form and using a caff distiller. Notice how it's extremely similar to coffee distiller. Um, and you could basically add sweetener, milk, whatever you wanted, and there were even calf shops on Coruscant, uh, Mandalore as well, you could have spiced calf, there were many varieties of this drink. So another really cool fact about calf is that it used to be drunken by Jedi uh, in the Old Republic until they decided it was no longer beneficial for your connection with the Force to be drinking stimulants, and then it was banned from the Order and it's kind of similar to modern day religion and ancient religions, stimulants being very detrimental to spirituality, so make of that what you will. So aside from calf, coffee actually does exist in Star Wars just like it does in the human world and just like the human world it's non-alcoholic generally speaking and you can have it hot and cold although most people in Star Wars preferred it hot. And this is the really interesting part of the video. Emperor Palpatine actually loved coffee so much so that he owned farms on various planets that provided beans to produce high quality coffee. He actually made a business out of it and he used this in the courts when he was um, a chancellor and coffee could be prepared basically by people who work for him. Which is very interesting to think that Emperor Palpatine enjoyed a hot cup of coffee to start his day. It kind of humanizes him in, a, in the strangest of ways that you probably couldn't conceive of. In fact, just thinking that Palpatine drank coffee, for me, is the most bizarre part of his personality. He wanted control of the galaxy, but not before he had a hot cup of coffee. And I don't even want to know the kind of Sith lightning he would use if he didn't get his cup of coffee and he was groggy in the morning. Let's not even imagine that. Let's move on to the next one. So I don't even know if this one's worth mentioning, but the next caffeinated drink is just Coca-Cola. However, it's not in the films, in the books, you know, the novelizations, the comics or anything. This one has just been introduced by Galaxy's Edge, you know, at Disney. Uh, and it's the Star Wars version of Coca-Cola. And they even gave it a backstory, which I'm going to read to you. So Coca-Cola is a carbonated caffeinated soda served in plastic orb bottles. Uh, at various locations throughout Black Spire Outpost on the planet Batu, The beverage was imported by Jat Ka, uh, a Lerman male from the planet Megito, who sold it to travellers. And the writing that they write Coca-Cola on is in Orobesh. So that's basically just Coca-Cola served in a really funny BB-8 looking bottle, and they've given it a whole backstory which is hilarious. 
So those were the only caffeinated beverages I could find. There is Diet Coke um, for forms in Star Wars. There's Spiron Calf, which is a weaker form of calf. But apart from those, the ones I mentioned in this video are the main ones. And I still can't get over the fact that Emperor Palpatine drank coffee. So that's the video guys, please subscribe to my channel if you're new, hit like down below, hit the notifications bell to be alerted every time that I upload a new video, I'm very consistent on this channel, and I will see you next time, have a great rest of the day, no matter where you are in the galaxy.